Hello, FR Haythorn families. It is registration time, which means we have students select their options that they would like to take for the next school year. Uh, new this year, we're also going to have students rank those options so that we know which options they prefer over some of the other ones. So let's get started. Just going to walk you through the process so that it makes it easy for you guys uh, to do this. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to frhaythorn.ca. We're going to click on the quick links and we're going to click on the PowerSchool Parent Portal. This is going to take you to the student and parent por uh, sign in page for Elk Island Public Schools. Now it's really important that you use a parent account and not a student account. A student account will not allow you to rank your options. So use your uh, parent username and password to sign in. So we're going to do that here. Let's sign in. All right. So we've logged into the parent portal. Now what we're going to do is on the left hand side we're going to go down to where it says class registration so my mouse is over top of that right now so i click on class registration and it's going to open up another page so this uh, page is for a grade 8 student so we're going to say grade 8 options grade 8 alternate options grade 8 core um, so the core we're not going to do anything with those are ones that you don't have an option for you you go you, everybody takes those no matter what so you're going to leave those alone the only two we're going to wor worry about or do any selections in is the top two which is options and alternate options so we're going to go over to the little pencil on the right hand side we have the little exclamation mark let us know that we need to do something in there and we're going to click on that now within this box here you have to select between four to six courses um, the reason why it's four to six is that if you choose band or French, they both count as two. So the total needs to be added up to six, um, it, regardless of the number of options you take, but band and French count as two. So we're going to do, I'm just going to choose six uh, random options. So two, three, four, five, six. Now if you look at the bottom here, it says you have selected six courses. It will allow you to keep going, so you can do more than six, so make sure you only select six. In this uh, scenario, if I were to have d done band, I would take one off and I would have done, um, oh, sorry, one more, uh, five courses rather than six. Okay, so we're just going to go back. We're going to say uh, five courses, six courses, and now we're ready to go. Okay, so now we're going to go into our alternates. Now the alternates, we're going to do our best to give you the top six, but if we can't get those top six, we're going to ask you to give us two additional. Now keep in mind, and this is the same on the last page, we have three pages of options. So we're on the first page, so we can go to the second page and the third page, and it'll list all the options that we do offer. Uh, so I'm going to choose World of Sports, and let's do Lego Robotics as my two alternates, and I'm going to click OK. Now, I need to scroll down. Remember, we don't need to do anything with these last two. Um, we're going to click Submit. This is going to automatically take me to a rank course requests page. Remember, our uh, core courses, we don't rank. We have to take those. You have no choice. But what we can rank are the eight that we selected. So we can go through and choose, well, I want art as my number one. I would like commercial foods as my number two, and so on. So I'm just going to go through and choose a number for all of these. Five, six, seven, eight. Eight. So now I have ranked all eight of my options. I'm going to click submit and I am done. We have selected all of our options and we've gone through and ranked them. All right. So hopefully this helps out. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact the school.